Hey guys, and welcome back to another video. Today I'm going to show you how to make a cheap, super high temperature heating mantle. In a previous video, we made a high temperature heating mantle that could be easily altered to accept different sized round bottom flasks, and this is just a quick continuation. The heating mantle previously made works very well, however there is a lot of conductive heat loss into the surrounding steel, so for applications requiring very high temperatures, some sort of thermal insulation is necessary. These high temperature heating tapes can be purchased on AliExpress for a few dollars and reach temperatures up to 700 degrees Celsius when properly thermally insulated. To better insulate the heating tapes, I picked up a few old metal thermoses from the second hand store. This size of thermos seems to fit a 100 milliliter beaker or 100 milliliter round bottom flask very well, but if you're wanting a different sized heating mantle, just look for a different thermos size. To begin, a hacksaw and some pliers were used to chop off the plastic casing from the thermos. It is important to be careful during this step, as the thermos is evacuated, and if it is punctured, the insulating capabilities will be dramatically reduced. Next, a heating tape is wrapped around the beaker so that the leads exit near the top. Some thin copper wire was woven between the sections of heating tape to hold everything together, and some excess copper was left at the top to attach it to the thermos. It is important to ensure that the beaker fits snugly inside the heating mantle to ensure the best possible heat transfer. The heating mat was then placed inside the thermos until adjusted appropriately, and then the copper wires were wrapped around the thermos to secure everything. A second thermos was also prepared in the same way to accept the round bottom flask. Next, the thermoses must be attached to a paint can lid so that they can be interchanged with the other sizes of heating mantles. This was done by simply cutting a hole in the lid, and then using wire to hold them in place. Just like the other heating mantles, this one can easily connect to the leads inside the paint can so that different sizes can be quickly swapped out. We now have a normal 100 milliliter, 500 milliliter, and 1000 milliliter heating mantle, plus a high temperature 100 milliliter heating mantle, and a high temperature heating mantle for beakers. As a side note, these insulated heating mantles should only be used near maximum power when the glassware contains something, as they can get hot enough to soften the borosilicate glass. Keep an eye out for future videos where we test these out. I hope you guys enjoyed, and I'll see you in a future project. Okay, bye.